My name is Takashi Akasaka. I'm the professor of medicine, Department of Cardiovascular Medicine of um, Wakayama Medical University in Japan. Uh, today, I talk about the OCT guided PCI, present status and future perspectives. As you may know, uh, IBAS guided PCI demonstrate superiority in the uh, prognosis of the patient compared with angio-guided PCI, and the recently developed OCT may allow us to obtain not only a short access view, but also the longitudinal, uh, longitudinal access view, and also the 3D reconstruction at the same time during uh, angiography. We can get an uh, five to uh, ten centimeter uh, imaging uh, within a two second and also uh, recent developed OCT demonstrate uh, 3D reconstruction with an automatic uh, presentation of stent strut and it's quite useful at the time of uh, OCT guided PCI. And also, uh, we can get an lumen profile. It's demonstrate the uh, mean diameter change of the vessel longitudinally. Using lumen diameter, uh, uh, we try to decide the uh, landing zone and stent size and stent length. And there are two important uh, studies recently demonstrating non-inferiority of OCT guided PCI compared with IWAS guided PCI. One is a named opinion study, the other one is Illuminum 3 study. These two studies demonstrated non inferiority of OCT guided PCI compared to IWAS guided PCI. However, we are expecting much more usefulness of OCT compared with IWAS because. Uh, the measurement is much more accurate compared with IVAS, and also uh, we can easily identify the tissue characterization, and furthermore, uh, reproducibility of the measurement is much better in OCT compared with IVAS. And furthermore, uh, as I told you, auto detection of uh, the incomplete opposition detectance is very useful to identify the stent uh, condition. So under expansion and incomplete opposition, easily identified using recently developed system. And furthermore, 3D reconstruction demonstrate uh, wonderful uh, uh, demonstration of the uh, 3D at the site of uh, bifurcation region. And using this system, we can easily identify the, uh, the position of the wire and also the stent strut and uh, the, uh, the relation between those two conditions. And using this, we can expect much better result in case with uh, bifurcation region treatment. Uh, furthermore, we have a much more uh, important development in the field of OCT. For example, uh, micro OCT, it's a resolution is 10 times higher, and also uh, the combination with NIAS. So NIAS OCT may give us much more important information. Therefore, in the future, we will have a much better result by OCT guided PCI compared with IVAS guided and angio guided PCI. So in conclusion, in the near future, OCT guided PCI might be the main uh, stream of uh, image guidance PCI.